Hey everyone, welcome to Universal City Walk. Today we're gonna have some lunch over here at the Cowfish restaurant we've never been to before. Super excited. And then we're gonna do some shopping over in City Walk. So come with us, it's gonna be a fun day. Got an excellent aquarium over here right when you walk into Cowfish with this giant sushi burger and then all of the fish swimming around the burger. That <laughs> is so awesome. You <laughs> could just look at these guys the entire time we're here. But we gotta go to our table and order food. Um, so this is one of those rare times that I actually forgot to record the menu, so apologies. But this is the Crab Rangoon dip with the wonton chips. And you guys, oh my goodness, does this look amazing? And then we got a wonderful IPA beer to go with it. Already starting off cowfish experience, 10 out of 10. This looks fantastic. entree time we went for the fusion specialty bento box which was $23 this is a combo meal featuring both burger and sushi so you get a mini burger with American cheese pickles chopped red onion sweet potato fries we swapped out for regular fries which is allowed and no extra charge amazing Thai cucumbers edamame and your choice of a fusion specialty roll four pieces of marks a firecracker or the boss we went with the firecracker and it was amazing We came upstairs to check out the second level of the restaurant and also just FYI this is where the restrooms are just in case uh, so even if they don't have the second level open you can still come up here and use the restroom and also there's a pretty incredible view out this window you can come over here and look out onto all of City Walk and across the little lagoon here over to Tusum Hard Rock uh, you can see the Hulk coaster going by over there really amazing view up here from the second level of Cowfish had an amazing experience I would totally come back here again food was incredible now it's time to shop. Let's go into the Universal Studio store. surprised to see actual Florida stuff. It's usually Universal Studios, but they have some Universal specific Orlando Resort and Universal Studios Florida. Hmm. Interesting. Sling bag is kind of cool. There's a very large selection of bags. Um, I kind of enjoy this one. Crossbody. It's a good size. Not bad. It's kind of subtle with the logo on it, too. Not bad. It's not screaming universal. It's subtle. I like these, too. These are cool. A little bit bigger. Not bad. Uh, 
might get this one. 30. That's not too bad. Looks like a good size. Okay, here we go. Here's what we were looking for. The old school logo. Crossbody bag with the see the stars or ride the movies. The old slogan for Universal. We're getting this. Be a larger selection of minion merchandise nowadays now that we're getting into the minion land and the new minion ride there's a lot more despicable me things and your assorted plushies from trolls shrek hello kitty spongebob squarepants over here And even some Simpsons. Look at that. Lots of Simpsons merchandise. Anyone for a souvenir sipper? 20 bucks. First fill is free. Carry around a big donut with you. Drink out of a donut all day long. Little Marvel section over here. Spidey, Avengers. Captain America, Hulk. And some also some Universal Orlando Resort merchandise. With the Marvel superheroes. Still lots of Jurassic Park merch. Jurassic World. I always like this backpack. So you open the doors. And there's your guy. Hello. Thank you. Dino Sipper, anyone? $20 and your first fill is free. E.T. Lounge Fly is adorable. Also, Back to the Future Lounge Fly. Very cool. Mm -hmm. So many pins. So many pins. Oh wow, look at this one. It's VillainCon VIP. That's got the grand opening ribbon on it, so that's cool. $14. Grand opening of the new ride. Awesome. Oh, look at those. Super cute. Oh, another favorite. Very good. Found some excellent chocolate treats. ET, Universal Studios, Florida, old school logo. Jaws chocolate bar. You get the old school confrontation bar. The old Kong, not the new Kong, the old one where the mummy is now. Old confrontation, retro, OG. Universal Monsters. Awesome. I love how they have these kiosks out here with the retro merchandise. Got a Back to the Future one, which is amazing. And also, the retro logo. All the original rides, E.T. Confrontation, Jaws, Back to the Future. From when the park originally opened in the 90s. Awesome. Oh, we've even got Ghostbusters over here. Whoa, love to see Ghostbusters making a comeback. Heck yes. Support that 100%. Heck yes. And Jaws. Oh, bring back this ride. Bring back this ride. Come on. So good. What's over there now? Harry Potter? Whatever. I mean, fine, but still. Jaws. This ride was so good. 
Love it. Absolutely love it. Alright, that's going to do it here for our day at City Walk. Lunch at Cowfish was amazing. And I would also like to mention that we were able to use our Universal Studios food and beverage card that we had purchased for Mardi Gras. Uh, we still had some money left over on it, surprisingly. And so we were able to use that towards our bill at Cowfish, which was awesome. It took some of the... Um, took almost like 40% off the bill because we still had about um, $25, $30 left on the cars. We were able to use that at Cowfish and that was amazing. Um, you're able to use that card at any of the Universal owned restaurants as well as the Mardi Gras um, food booths inside the park. So hey, if you have some left over, you can put it towards a nice dinner or a nice lunch. Um, that was totally amazing. Now we're just on the boat here taking a ride back to our hotel ready to leave hope to come back soon hope you guys enjoyed this video of our little uh, lunch and shopping excursion at city walk please give us a thumbs up if you did and we will see you guys again soon cheers